In this video, I'm going to show you how to insert an image into a cell in Google Sheets. I'll show you how to do this using the insert option, and then I'll show you how to use the image function to do this. So the first way is just to use um, the insert option in the top menu here. So what you want to do is select the cell um, where you want the image to appear, and then insert, and then there's this insert image. So you can do image in cell, image over cells. I'm going to do in this example just image in cell. And so here you have a few different options from where your image comes from. You can upload one from your computer um, by hitting browse and then you select the image you want to upload and you just upload it. If you have a camera attached to your device, you can take a picture um, by selecting this camera option. You can put in um, the URL of an image and use that inside of your spreadsheet. Um, you can connect to the Photos app if you have um, pictures inside of there that you want to use. If you have images inside of your Google Drive um, that you want to put into your spreadsheet, um, you can click Google Drive and do that. Or you can do an image search and um, search for images here to put inside of your spreadsheet. Um, I'm going to do a URL in this example. So I just have the uh, Google logo URL. And I'm going to put that and insert the image. Um, so you can see it is now inside the cell. So that is the insert option, um, which is pretty easy. The next thing I'm going to show you is actually using the image function itself. Um, so this is the syntax of the image function. Um, the first thing you need is URL. Um, and then the rest of the parameters here are optional. Um, mode is going to specify the size. So there's different sizing rules you can do with this function. Um, you can choose between one, two, three, and four for this parameter. Um, so one is going to resize your image to fit inside of a cell while maintaining aspect ratio. Two is going to compress or stretch the image without maintaining aspect ratio. Three is going to keep the image at its original size. And then four will allow you to set a custom size. Um, so these third and fourth parameters of height and width are only available if you choose four. So what you do with four, uh, when you have four as your parameter, is then you put in pixels what you want your height and width of the image to be. Um, so to just show you how this works, let me do um, the image function with this URL here. So by default, if I don't specify a mode, it's going to be set to mode one. So you can see that is the same as doing mode one. Um, so I can either do the cell reference of the URL or I could do um, the URL itself in my function but if you're going to do the URL itself you have to put the URL inside quotation marks otherwise it won't work um, and an important thing to know is that you need this protocol here this HTTPS that has to be inside your URL too and um, Google Drive URLs don't work it has to be a real URL of an image so mode 1 Again, it, it will resize it while maintaining aspect ratio. Two, you can see that it stretched it and it's not maintaining its aspect ratio. Um, mode three here, um, it's not showing up. That's because it's so large that you probably have to expand. Um, yeah, you can see it's starting to show up after I expand it enough because it's maintaining its original size. Um, so let's just go back so we don't have to look at that. And then four is where you specify in pixels the height and width. I'm just going to do 75, 75. And that is using the image function. So those are two different options for inserting images into your cells in Google Sheets. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.